Hello everyone and welcome to the Saddleback at Dokes Creek Farm. It is Terry and I am excited to visit with you today about a beneficial farm critter that is not necessarily one of my favorites because it's a little slithery, but this is something that I have never experienced before and I wanted to share it with you. Before we get started, I would just like to remind you to please hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you'll be notified as soon as new videos are released. But also, I would encourage you to comment, especially so we can get to know each other. But even after you watch this video, if you have new information to share, because I'm not a, um, an expert on this particular farm critter, then you may have new information to share with me and everyone else. So please do so. So let me just tell you, I'm sitting here on the porch and there is a paving stone that's right next to me. And under the paving stone, I found a wonderful kind of surprise because again these are not my favorite but a beautiful surprise so let me show you what I found you'll notice here I'm going to pull up the paving stone and we'll see what is there it is a mama skink or lizard and I assume these are her eggs and you can tell that she has had five she's a little nervous because I've exposed her little hiding place but you can see her just kind of moving those around and why the, she is so beneficial to the farm is actually because she eats insects and it's kind of a control especially from gardening standpoint now we do have beneficial insects too so we don't want her eating those but she is very helpful on the farm so we want to keep her around now since this is my first time actually seeing lizard eggs, I had to do some research and it's my understanding it can be hard to tell the difference between her eggs and actually snake eggs sometimes. And actually some people even confuse them for bird eggs. So I'm going to tell you what I found out and you may have something different so please share that with me. So her eggs, and I did kind of touch these, these eggs actually are leathery and soft and apparently snake eggs are also the same. They're got in that soft leathery texture. The difference between these eggs of a lizard and a snake egg is actually the snake eggs stick together. They're both called clusters but the snake eggs actually will stick to each other. So if you were to pick up one egg, it's likely that there actually will be others attached to it. Where obviously you can see that the mama eggs here, the, from this lizard or skink is actually, they're separate. Now, what is the difference between snake, lizard, and a bird egg? The bird eggs are going to have a harder shell. There is still a thin shell, but it's going to be a harder shell. So that's how you can kind of tell the difference. Because if this skink, wasn't with these eggs then we could easily assume that they are snake eggs right but we know probably very likely that these are lizard eggs because she's with them so isn't this a wonderful surprise to find i've never experienced this and i'm happy to share this with you if you like this video i would encourage you to please again subscribe and hit that notification bell so that you can be notified when other videos come out and especially again please comment if you actually have more information to share and also like and share this video so that we can continue growing the page and channel. So thank you again. And until we meet again, as we say here in the South, y'all come back now. <laughs>